selective service, big time playmaker. And more on today's news. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, hot dogs. I'm Abby. And I'm Latham. Today is the last day of the Lost and Found table. If you've lost anything, come by and look to see if your item turned up. The U.S. Senate Youth Program has a scholarship available. For more information on that, check the chatter. For lunch today, on lines one and two, chicken smackers or subs, line three is closed, line four is soup and salad bar with chicken rice soup, and line five, Big Daddy Pizza. A happy birthday goes out to Jeremy Aaron, Giovanni Cruz Rojas, and Samuel McGowan. All 18-year-old and soon-to-be 18-year-old males, it is required by law that you are registered for the Selective Service. If you have any questions about registration or the Selective Services, see Mr. Quick. Here is a reminder for prayer at the poll, which happens at 7.10 a.m. every Thursday. Now let's hear it from Victor with sports results from last night. Last night, the Frankfurt Hot Dogs hosted South Mount Mounties in regular season conference play. Frankfurt started off rough when Mounties scored five minutes into the match. The score woke the Hot Dogs up and senior Chris Hernandez would score on an unassisted play a minute later. Chris Hernandez would score a second goal in the first half with the second goal being assisted by senior Daniel Mejia Cervantes. Senior Leo Mejia scored with an assist by sophomore Yovi Tronado. Leo Mejia set up senior Alex Beltran's goal late in the first half, who then assisted senior Noel Mora to give the Frankfurt a 5-1 lead going into halftime. Frankfurt recorded three more goals in the second half. The first two were unassisted goals by, Sal by senior Salvador Peña Garcia and Yovi Tornado. The last goal of the night was scored by junior Rudy Garcia Cruz and assisted by Yovi Tornado. The Hot Dogs are now 73 on the season and 4-1 in conference play. Frankfurt travels to Covington to participate in their invitational tournament on Saturday. Their first match is at 9 against Covington. The boys tennis team got the victory last night against North Montgomery 5-0. Their next match is tomorrow. The team will be traveling to face off against Carroll at 5. The girls volleyball game will be live tomorrow, so if you are not able to make it to the game, you can watch it on the ISC apps and on Hot Dog Network. That's it for sports, now on over to weather with Lathan. Thanks Victor. For weather today, expect it to be sunny. Praise be the sun. The high will be around 80 with mid-level humidity again. There's no chance of rain today either though. That's pretty much it for weather, let's head back over to Abby. Greetings, Frankfurt High School, Peyton Manning here. Many of you have already heard, but in the slim chance you haven't, Frankfurt was set ablaze yesterday with Manning's personal message to Frankfurt High School. Congratulations to Coach Byers and the football team for winning the Rydell's 2019 Smarter Football Program grant. There were over 800 entries from all around the country, and Frankfurt was one of the 10 schools collected. The grant winners announced by Manning will receive $10,000, which the schools can use to update their equipment with right out gear, which is a blessing for our football team. No more shoulder pads tied with zip ties. That's all we have for you today. Be sure to like and subscribe to stay up to date with our broadcasts and other Frankfurt happenings. Happy Hump Day, hot dogs. We'll see you tomorrow.